first game as a Celtic, how did it feel for you? Felt good. Uh, definitely a good test. It was fun to go out there. Obviously fun to play in Madison Square Garden, first game, and kind of feel this type of rivalry. So it was a good test for us. What did you learn about this team? Resilient. Um, we might have we're down 10 points with, with uh, four minutes to go. Uh, we always have a chance. So uh, I think we kind of just band together, um, started executing on, on both ends of the floor, and <clears throat> got the necessary plays that we needed. You had to bring the guys together in a few huddles you know, during some of the Knicks runs. What were you trying to tell them in those moments? Just that we got enough time. Uh, there's always enough time to, to just kind of settle in and, and uh, get back into the game. I know those runs, I think the last one came quick. Uh, right out of a timeout, so we know we know that we can be poised. We know what kind of talent we have, and, and we just go out there and lock in. What did you notice? You guys still need work through offensively, especially through some of those more stagnant stretches. Um, you know, maybe getting some screens, uh, thinking quicker to get the advantage that we want. If we have if I have a small, me go up there and set the screen and uh, try to play out of that. Maybe JB or JT can either attack that, or maybe they get mixed up. I, I'm open for a three or layup or something like that. So. Um, just going back in a, a little bit more ball movement. Yeah, how yeah. steep is the learning curve with so many drivers out there? Um, it's fun, you know, uh, knowing people's tendencies, what they like to do, uh, learning it on the fly or, or being able to execute it on the fly. Uh, it's kind of what preseason's for, but uh, this first game was a good test for us. Is this opening night victory that much more special? Oh, yeah. Uh, it's, it's always great to win your first game, but in Madison Square Garden, it's, it's pretty cool, too. Sometimes we make the mistake of thinking we're watching the finished product. You know, what did you kind of learn that y you guys maybe can still get to know each other so much, or how do you, how do you feel? For sure, it? I think it's only been a few weeks. Um, obviously, KP had a great game being back here, but um, again, uh, I think one of the things I probably focus on is when we get those leads, being able to hold those leads. We know in this league it's very very hard to, to hold a lead, no matter if it's 20 points. But um, I think you know that's going to be a, a step in our execution, being able to. Uh, when we're up on guys and, and being able to control the game. First time with these guys, what did you think though about you know when the adversity came? You'd held the lead, you gave it up. What did you make of what your team, you know, your new teammates did? Yeah, I think we did a great job. Um, obviously, getting the win uh, shows that, but I do feel like our, our team has um, great guys, great character. So just a lot of poise. Uh, nobody got rattled or shaken, and uh, went out there and executed and got the win. Drew, what do you relish about when you have the defensive challenges against like, a guy like Julius? Uh, well, for one, we're teammates, so uh, it's always fun to go against them. Um, obviously, somebody who's a little bit bigger, a little bit stronger. Uh, I think for me, just one of my plans was keeping him off the boards, trying not to foul him. I got an and one, or he got an and one on me there. That was uh, my mistake, but um, really just taking on the challenge, being able to be that guy. What was the conversations like, you know, Al coming off the bench, going into this game, you and Derek starting? You know, did you guys kind of all get together with Joe? Did he have those individually with you? Um, there was some individual, but uh, us six went together and talked about it. Um, and honestly, it's about what we can do for the team. Um, no matter who starts, no matter who finishes, uh, we, we all want to win. And we're all on the same page. So when it comes down to it, winning is, is our only option and the only thing we really want to do. Presented by your New England Ford dealers. Built for America. Built Ford Proud.